I wanted to talk about something that um, I just stumbled along that is a really easy way to get a nice smooth finish on, well not flat surfaces, but sort of surfaces without detail. So I was rummaging around in my little workshop and I found this. Now uh, this is a cabinet scraper. I used to use this for woodworking, but I grabbed it and I was like, hey, I wonder if this would work on 3D prints. And it does really well. You just scrape it along the surface, and you really got to keep an eye on the surface because as you a, a, as you look at it, you'll see a, a slight color difference. I doubt you can pick it up on the on the camera, but see, look at all those shavings coming up. Those are imperfections in the surface, and they just scrape right off. Now you have to keep an eye, especially on like these rounded surfaces that you don't flatten things out. So what I like to do is I'll just turn the work as I'm going over it, and that helps from flattening it out. And then if you get like um, faceted areas, you can just smooth that out with a little fine sandpaper but it carves those ridges off, those layer lines, like they weren't even there. And, <coughs> uh, excuse me. Now, you can pick these up, I think, anywhere from 10 to, I don't know, 20 bucks, something like that. They're just a flat sh sheet of metal. Some of them have, this one has a little curved corner. Some of them have curved edges that might be a little better. Um, you can pick those up online. I got this, I don't know, I doubt you can see the logo on here. I got this at Stu Mac. They're a Luther Supply. Um, I think Home Depot sells them. Um, you can probably get them all over the, the, the internet. Um, but if you don't want to go to that crazy expense, I found you can do the same thing with a razor blade. Just scrape it along the surface. See? Look at all those that comes up and you can get rid of all those layer lines and get a smooth, smooth finish. Now, obviously it's not good for certain things. Like in here, this has got sort of a swoopy section. It's gonna be really hard to get in there because you wanna go over the lines, not along with them. And it's not gonna work in there. So it's not good for everything, but for certain areas, you can really get a nice finish with it. Um, so, you wanna go full hog, you can get a cabinet scraper. Um, they're not very expensive, and all you wanna do is keep this edge nice and flat for a sharp edge. You put the piece of sandpaper on a flat surface. Now this is really not hard enough, but, and then you just rub it over like that, and you'll get a nice sharp surface again. They're easy as pie to sharpen. Or, like I said, just grab a razor blade. It'll do the same thing. When 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 it dulls up on you, throw it out and get a new razor blade. These, these cost almost nothing. You can get a pack of these, you know, easy. Both of them will give you baby smooth surfaces. Get rid of those layer lines in seconds. Um, it has limited applications, sure, but where it works, it works really, really well. So, there you go, just a little finishing tip.